Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride on a one horse open sleigh. When it comes to doing season, you know Santa don't play. Y'all, the reason we start popping got about 90k. Just subscribe to the channel and keep buying the gear. Y'all been waiting, good one season, yes, it's finally here. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Mr. Tree Hulu, and I am joined my, by my co-host. I am Madam Pencil Lulu. And we are the Who's. Welcome to Goodwin Season. Welcome to Goodwin Season. Today, it is the Goodwin Season Holiday Championship Bake Off. Oh my God, and I am so excited to see how this turns out. Me too, I <laughs> love sweets. Yes. I'll introduce them. How about you go first, dear? Okie dokie. The first contestant that we have, her name is Morgan Goodwin. What's up, you guys? For those who don't know me, my name is Morgan Goodwin. I am 27 years old and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. Um, today, you guys may see I am baking, doing a bake off against my husband who thinks he can bake, which we both have no baking experience, but he's a little bit better in the kitchen when it comes to baking because I don't bake. Um, but you know what? I'm just gonna go out there and show what I got. Use all my skills and my taste buds. I'm really good at flavors. So hopefully I can go in this kitchen and come out with a bang and come out with this win. I'm ready to kick some butt, okay? Our next contestant, his name is Marquis? Marquis? I know some of y'all know who I am, but <laughs> I'm gonna go and lay it down right quick. I am Marquise. I keep it real, don't do faking. All my food tastes good no matter what I'm making. I'm serious. You think you beating me? You just wishing. My name should be George Foreman the way I'm king of the kitchen. Hey, I need it bad. I want it bad. I'm like that. My wife gonna be sad. Got the bars. I can keep going if y'all want to. What, what, what more y'all want, man? I already, I'm gonna win the comp off of that alone. Well, let's get started. Let's go. So, um, how it's gonna work? There's a two-part um game, right? It's, it's, it's two parts. Two parts. Two. Two parts okay. to the competition. Two. And what they're gonna do is they're gonna come out here and they're gonna bake. They're gonna first make their batter or their dough, mm -hmm. and then. The second half, they're okay. going to bake and they're going to decorate. Okay, okay. So the judges are going to choose based on the, the taste, the look, the texture, and just the overall appearance. <laughs> hey, you ready? Appearance and everything, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't wait to see how this goes, right? Let's see how it goes. Okay, good one season, stay tuned. Hey, wait hey, a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> You guys thought we were gonna let you sneak by us without hitting that subscribe button. Hit the subscribe button. You better hit that Give subscribe button. Give this video button. a thumbs up and comment down below. <laughs> <laughs> and I went, and when she says down below, she doesn't mean where the tree, the presents are. <laughs> okay, all right, let's get to the next. See you there. All right, bakers, open your basket and see what's inside. Whew. Oh. Brown sugar, powdered sugar, I'm actually a little hungry. Bakers, this is round number one. You have 30 minutes on the clock, and your time starts now. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
You panicking over there. Girl? I mean, boy? <laughs> about me. Just know I'm about to win. <laughs> How much is three fourths? Three fourths just do one. Three quarters. Four. Oh, like this. I ain't telling her. Forgot we ain't helping each other in the kitchen. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm about to botch this real. Oh my gosh. I almost this was gonna be tragic. Three fourths a teaspoon. I almost botched this bad, y'all. Mm. Teaspoon. Mm. I want some of your brown sugar. Oh my gosh, did you see how Morgan used the real ginger? My goodness, did I? I chose to use fresh ginger um, because I knew that the fresh ginger was gonna bring in a bang with the spice. So I used the hint of fresh ginger and I also used ground ginger. So hopefully it's not too powerful with the judges or too, too much of a taste for the judges, but if they're anything like me, I love ginger, okay? So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I wonder how that's oh. gonna taste. It might be a wha-pow in the mouth, oh right? My, oh my goodness, it'll <laughs> make a world of a difference. I can't wait to see goes. it. Oh, wow. I was born a winner. Marquis, good win? It's not good lose, is it? Oh, what's up, brother? Oh man, just in here winning a bacon championship. I'm going against Mo. What you think, man? Oh, man, you already know you're going to be here. Nah, yeah. Don't tell us this. I said it. I ain't going to tell her, bro. We ain't going to tell her. I'm going to hit you after the comp because I'm doing the interview right now. Say what's up to Goon Caesar. Oh, what's happening, Goon Caesar? Yeah. Hey, I'll top it up with you after. It's going to be quick. Let me go ahead and get this dub and I'll hit you back. I love you, bro. Love you too, bro. Now, what was the next question? Yeah. Gingerbread, how you gonna have a gingerbread <laughs> without the ginger? Don't need no mix You know what, I'm gonna add a little bit Woo! of ginger sauce. She can attempt. Just a little bit. Her cookie's gonna be grainy. I already know, they ain't gonna be smooth. You see this? That's whipped like butter. Look at the color. How you doing over there? <laughs> Guess that's bad. I wouldn't answer me either. <laughs> I'm finished. I'm ready for the mixer. Ah! I'm ready. Okay. Yeah, boy. <clears throat> She don't know what she got coming against, what she's working against. This right here, this recipe has been in my family for about 30 minutes. So I look forward to seeing what, seeing how it turn out. When they asked me to come on the show, I'm just like, man. Y'all want a winner on the show. Y'all really want somebody to come win. Cause y'all asking me. Of course. I'm not going. I'm a winner! Where the whisk? <laughs> you can't use all items. Cheers. Wipe it off. Don't get none of my flavor. I, I definitely don't want this. Look like not the right thing. It ain't the right color. And that matters. It's not all about the taste. It's 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 presentation too. You ain't gonna like no cookies that don't look good, right? Thank you. Okay. So I think I'm about ready. Are you done with the mixer? Yep. About time. Here, <laughs> wash this out, okay? Loser. I wash it out. Look at you. Ooh, I cut myself on this thing. I'm gonna cut myself again, so. Let me be 
care. These so trash. Oh my god. So weak. Why are you tasting my stuff? I ain't taste. I just looked at it. I told you. Don't taste. I ain't tasting nothing. Why would I want to taste your stuff? You acting like everybody over here just oh. tasting your stuff. I'm ready to go in. Stuff is thicker than Morgan Goodwin. Mm. Come on now, come on. I got dough. I got dough. Real talk. I'm gonna put mine in the bottom, right there by the sweet tea. Hey. Oh, Miss Hulu, what do you think about what's going on in this competition? Well, I saw Marquis Goodwin. He started with his his wet first, mm -hmm. and then he yeah, did, I noticed and then that. he did his drying reading. I noticed that. Yeah, Morgan started with her drying ingredients first, and then her wet ingredients afterwards. So, so we got gonna, the best of both worlds. Yeah, we're gonna see how this. See which process is better. Did you see Morgan? How fast she finished making that dough? Yeah. It earned her an extra 10 minutes. Well, let's see if her dough ends up being, you know, Let's good. see. Let's see. Because when you tend to rush and you try to get through things fast just to get the extra time, it doesn't always marinate as exactly how it's supposed to. So let's hope that dough sticks together and let's hope that she does well. And now it's time for round two. So for round two. For round two? You want to explain round two? I think I'll let you take it. Yay! <laughs> 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 All right, so, so for round two, the bakers are going to bake their cookies, mm -hmm. and then they're going to decorate their cookies. Yeah. And as you know, yeah. Morgan has the extra time for decoration, so let's see how she ends up doing. I okay. Hope she does well with that extra time. Yes. Yeah. Now let's get round two started. It's time to bake. make sure this is mine because he could use mine and try to cheat. <sighs> I don't know y'all. Let me get some flour. <laughs> mm, it ain't look right. Something ain't look right about that. <laughs> we gonna see yours. <laughs> we gonna see. Stay on your ass, please. Don't infect my side. Oh, that's what it is. Talking about some lightly flour. No, you gotta flour this mug or else it's gonna stick to your thing. Alright, here we go. I know. I might have to do these whole. Womp, womp, womp. Okay, change of plans. Can I get mine out? Yeah. I hate to see it. I just hate to see it, man. <laughs> mm hmm. You see mine. Oh. Woo! <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, she ain't gonna roll hers up. I definitely fumbled the bag um, when it came to rolling out my gingerbread because I didn't know that the gingerbread was gonna be that consistency. So I really needed to put a lot of flour on the bottom of the. Um, table so that my gingerbread didn't stick but i figured it out and thank god i got my <laughs> gingerbread on the pan in time i think i did pretty well i taste my batter um before i put it in the refrigerator and my batter tastes really good i mean it was absolutely amazing so oh i smell it <laughs> you your job right now Put yours on. 
for one minute. Let me check what it looked like. <laughs> Ginger dead cookies. <laughs> <laughs> oh. My cookies are looking a little weak, but you know what? It might, you know, I don't know. I pull my cookies out of the oven and they don't look as good as is. <laughs> but hopefully the taste wins the judge is over. Cause right now I'm over it. I'm just keeping my design simple. The taste is gonna speak for itself. My cookie already pretty. You know what I'm saying? Like my wife, she don't even gotta wear makeup. Her cookies need makeup, but she don't really need makeup. See you scrambling. Oh, oh, don't drop anything. One minute. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hands up. <laughs> Baby. And we're going to introduce you to the judges. And the first judge we have is Tamina Goodwin. She specializes in candy eating. Her other specialty is being a full-time mom and grandparent, and she loves sweets. Our second contestant is Latina Jennings, and she's a very experienced baker, and she bakes for a living on the side. Her specialties are pound cake, German chocolate cake, and her signature dish is the banana pudding cake. And our last judge, Tashiana Ho, better known as Nene. And she can do the Nene, but not right now. She specializes in cooking nothing. But she has the taste buds of a champion. And these are our judges. Judges, you may try your first cookie. Okay, that's good. It's soft. It's fluffy. It's got some fluffiness to it. The sweetness is good. It tastes like candy. I taste the gingerbread. It's the gingerbread cookie. I taste the gingerbread in it. It's pretty good. I like that. Yeah. Um, piggybacking off of what she said, I can really taste the ginger flavor in it. Um, it's really moist. Um, has a great texture to it. It's not gritty, not grimy. Um, pretty smooth. Yeah, I like the way that it tastes. It kind of like melts in your mouth. It's not too strong, not too sweet. You can taste the ginger in it. Um, it's something I would love to keep eating. Thank you. I'm trying to see what I taste in it. This one's a little more crunchier, like a little more crumbly than the first one. All around the taste is, I'm trying to see what that taste is. I can't pinpoint on it, but I'm sure Judge too will, cause she's a baker. <laughs> but um, I like it. it. It tastes a little different than gingerbread, than the, the first gingerbread cookie I tasted, but. 
Overall, I like it. It's sweet. So I like sweet so, but it's good. I like it. Yeah, this one is more like a cookie instead of a gingerbread cake. Like, um, it has a little crunch to it. Also, I tasted, I think, a little bit of orange zest, which might have been what you kind of taste. It has that little kick in the back of your palate. Um, but overall, it was just as good. It was a little bit more sugar in this one than the other one, but still not overpowering. Um, but great job. I agree with my judges here. Um, I can tell something was different in this one than the first one. And I like that I could bite in the, the little accessories that they have at the bottom it kind of added an extra taste um but it do taste more like a cookie but i do like it thank you so right now we have the judges standing here on the panel and they are going to discuss and figure out which cookie is the best so what do you guys think what do you ladies think so i like the way that one cookie has different unique styles mm -hmm. on them. But Perfect one taste. cookie, mm -hmm, you can kind of see the same type of design. Yeah, it. got triplets. Mm -hmm. Yeah, gotcha. One, she, you know, she, mm -hmm. one cookie has a different design. Yeah, and one is more of a cookie and one is more of like a cake-like mm -hmm. cookie. One has the crunch, one has the softness. The, uh, not, they're both pretty good, not gritty, not grainy. Um, overall, great job on both mm -hmm. of our contestants. Okay, cookie number one, um, it was a little thicker, a little more moist, moist to it. Um, cookie two, like you said, was more like a cookie, but um, the present, as far as the presentation, um, I think cookie two, okay. um, as far as presentation, mm -hmm. one over one, just because it was three different decorations right. on the cookie. Mm -hmm. Very great, very good. Yes. Okay. So, do you ladies know who the winner is? Would you like to delegate with each other and come up with one winner? Yeah. yeah. Okay, we have come to a unanimous decision. Um, we all went with cookie number. And the winner of the 2020 Goodwin Season Bake Off is... Mama, I want to thank God for letting my mama have me. First of all, I kind of knew something was wrong when I started to roll my bed out, okay? It started to break apart too easily. I just knew it was over from there. But I did try to decorate my cookies to the best of my ability. And I, I gave it my all. But the lady who made my recipe, Cookie number one had a little bit more depth to it. It was a little bit more thicker. It had a little bit more fluffiness to it, more like a gingerbread. Um, the second one was more like a cookie, even though we preferred the decorations on cookie number two. But overall, the texture and just the taste alone, we all went with cookie number one. All right, thank you all for joining us in this year's Goodwin Season Bacon Championships, hosted by Mr. Tree Who and Madame Tinsel Lou Who and we are the Lou Who's and you are now tuned into Goodwin Season again. If you are new to this channel, we want you to hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up and comment down below. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold, hold on, hold on. Oh, what else do they have to do? Turn on what? Those notifications! <laughs> Thank you.